Well, you can watch two local florists compete on a new Netflix show. For today's Coffee With, I talked to friends Sarah and Jordan about their experience. Your time starts now. The big flower fight is now on Netflix, a competition where teams create super-sized floral sculptures. We talked to Sarah Campbell and Jordan Marks, two Annapolis-based wedding florists who were on the show. Being on this show was a wild, wild ride, and it was so fun and so incredibly challenging. And pushed Sarah and I so far out of our comfort zone that it took us on a, a journey that we really weren't expecting, but every single moment was just amazing. And I'm pretty sure that if brides and grooms now want a giant beetle at their wedding, we, got, we can do it. If you want a wedding gown made completely out of flowers, we got it. They got the most comments on this burlesque ball gown during the floral fashion challenge. I loved that design. I thought it was so beautiful. You know, we wanted, we were over in Europe and we were doing this, that's where we were filming the competition. And we talked about ways that we could do something beautiful and showy that would kind of pull in Europe and America all at the same time, which is why we had kind of that Moulin Rouge meets Las Vegas feel with our burlesque gown. Sarah's business is called Intrigue Design and Decor. They are known for high-end, innovative floral designs. And for the last three years, she's been touring the country, teaching floral workshops and classes to other wedding designers. Flowers bring so much joy. And I know early in my career, well, I wasn't in the floral career, and I didn't even know that flowers was an option as a job path. So once I found flowers, I knew I wanted to help other people find this creative outlet that you can make a really good paycheck for doing. Sarah and Jordan hope to resume traveling and teaching soon, and they say their first tour stop will be in Baltimore. Follow them on Instagram at intrigue underscore designs. We'll be right back with more news and weather.